Welcome back to Bay Area Focus. Since 1995, the event Help is on the Way has raised over $3 million for aid services and programs to help the hungry and homeless. This year, they will celebrate with their 23rd annual gala, and it is going to be a night to remember with an amazing lineup of guests. Executive Director of RAFE, Ken Henderson, is here now to discuss the gala. And RAFE stands for Richmond Ermit Aid Foundation. So let's right. talk about how that got started. What's the history behind that? Well, the foundation was conceived by two moms, Barbara Richmond and Peggy Ermitt, who both lost their only sons to AIDS. They were lifelong friends whose the mothers, their parents were friends before they were born. And they grew up in the Bay Area. Uh, both their sons uh, contracted AIDS back in uh, the early 90s, and both the sons died. So the moms decided, rather than give in to the grief, they wanted to do something positive. So they called my partner, Joe Seiler, and I and said, we want to do a benefit. Will you help? And we said, sure. And they said, here, take it over. <laughs> <laughs> and you've been doing that for a very long time. 23 years, yeah. yeah. Who would have thought? <laughs> yeah, that's pretty amazing. How many shows a year does Rafe usually do? We do two big galas. This one that's coming up, Help Is On The Way, which is number 23, sure. putting on the glitz. We do a holiday version in December, and then we do a series of one-night-only cabaret shows with uh, touring Broadway cast in town. And this year, we have our second annual next big event called Broadway Bears SF. Okay. Big strip show, basically. Oh, okay. People think bears like big hairy guys, but no, this is like bearing it all. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so bears. Yeah. Bears it all. Yeah. Big difference. Sounds like a lot of fun and for a very good cause. Right. So tell me about uh, the beneficiaries of, of uh, this most recent show on August 20th. Yeah, beneficiaries this year are Meals on Wheels San Francisco. That's our hunger program that we support. And Positive Resource Center. They provide um, a lot of services. And they've recently acquired AIDS Emergency Fund and Baker's Places. So they're doing with housing. They're doing with just about everything that impacts people with HIV. Uh, and then how much money has RAFE, has it, how much has it raised for aid service organizations to date? I mean, it's been going on for a long time, so right. I'm sure it's, that's a uh, lot of money. probably about $3.5 million at this point. $3.5 million. Yeah. Have you found that the Bay Area really connects to that cause as well? Well, HIV and AIDS, people perceive it as something that's sort of over by now, although there's still thousands of people living with it in the Bay Area. Well, nationwide, it's like <laughs> many more. Yeah. But um, it's becomes harder and harder to get funding for. Uh, and a couple of years ago, we kind of looked at what was going on, the dynamics of the epidemic, and thought, okay, it's time to do something a little different. So we expanded our focus areas to include hunger programs and programs for homeless youth, which are also two areas that we felt like we could have a real impact on locally. And, you know, to causes that we feel passionately about too. Sure, it's still out there though, but it's not considered an AIDS crisis anymore. Yeah, people are living with HIV and AIDS now. People think like it's over, uh, treatment is good, people are living healthy lives. But, you know, it's still expensive to maintain. There's still a lot of issues. People are still contracting the disease. Sure. And it's something you still don't want to live with. Well, let's talk about this event a little bit more. Who are some of the performers? There's some pretty We've good ones, great, huh? We've got a great lineup, yeah. We have uh, last year's American Idol winner, Trent Harmon. Okay. Uh, he's going to be amazing. He's going to be doing the song that he actually won the show with last season. Uh, we have uh, Levi Christ, Broadway, our Tony Award winner for uh, playing Jerry Lee Lewis in Million Dollar Quartet. Um, last season, there was a great little show called Hairspray Live that uh, on television, and that was we have the two leads from that show, Garrett Clayton and Maddie Baio. Wow. We've got Grammy Award winning uh, Broadway actress uh, Maureen McGovern, local favorites Jason Brock, uh, Paula West. Uh, world champion salsa dancers, uh, Salsa Mania. Okay, we have the cast have of Something that. Rotten, the Broadway <laughs> cast of Something Rotten, too. Wow, so, so. amazing, amazing lineup this year. Yeah, it's going to be phenomenal. And you get a lot of people there every year. Yeah, we usually sell out. You know, it's, it's going to be at the Herbst Theater. That's about 950 seats. Big gallery receptions before and afterwards. So, you know, if there's not one thing, if you don't like one act, you can go up and have food and drink and martinis. You can party with the crowd. There's a nightclub theme party afterwards. So 
it's like three events in one almost. Yeah, it sounds like there's something for everyone at this event as well. Yeah. And there are other events throughout the year to support as well if you can't make this one. Right. But, yeah, so thanks so much for coming on the show and telling us all about that. And if you want to get tickets to help those in need, you just log on to RAFE. It's R-E-A-F dot org. Stick with us after the break. We have an author that draws on our history. We'll be right back.